Let me smash. Please. It's okay. It's okay. Hello, everyone.
everybody, we are here. We are going to be doing some uh, fabulous misfits. I am just finishing one last thing. Uh, if he is stepped away for a moment, so I am just finishing up one last thing I have to do. Um. There we go. But I hope everybody is having a wonderful Friday. For those who haven't been here before, my name is Alice. I will be running Fabulous Misfits Episode 4, uh, which I've realized apparently I have not been updating the description of on YouTube. Oops. <laughs> yeah, I have to go in and do that. Uh, the Episode 3 up or, uh, recap will be up in probably tomorrow. I'll probably set it for tomorrow noon. Um, it's good. Oh, I haven't even had a chance to see it yet. I'm glad you like it. Honestly, when I got to the point, when you get to the point with the King of the Hill joke, I fell out of my chair. Oh boy, I can't wait. I don't remember that. No, no, no. It, it's in this. It's in the recap video. Oh, okay. <laughs> but hello, actually here on time because I'm not allowed at work. Yeah, that's fair. That'll that'll happen to you. I hope you're feeling well. I had to go, to go home from work early. Well, not really early, but I clocked out early today. Isn't it less that you had to clock out early and more just you didn't have access to getting to and from work? I mean, I was already working. I, <laughs> I literally was just dropping off the stuff at the courthouse from work. <laughs> and I was supposed to be heading back. <laughs> so I had to call my boss and be like, I can't get back. Wait, why couldn't you get back? Your car broke down? My, yeah, my car broke down. I've definitely had the car. <laughs> I was texting I, Alice for like two hours while I was waiting for the tow truck. <laughs> it's it's true. I was getting the play-by-play. -play. They sent out a tech priest. It was wild. <laughs> uh, Is the machine spirit healed? healed? The machine spirit has been healed. Well, the funniest part was the tow truck had to be towed. Sorry, what? Yep. Yeah. Okay, I, gotta... uh, I need the flip notes version of what the hell happened. All right, Flash. Thank you for lurking. <laughs> All right, wouldn't start. I called the tow truck. Tow truck came. Tow truck broke down. Tow truck called the tow truck. <laughs> And then my car so started. No tow truck exception where like your car was on the first tow truck that was being pulled by the second tow truck. No, my car started when the second tow truck finally showed up. <laughs> like I said, they, they sent out a tech priest. Yeah. The second tow truck driver opened my hood, looked at the engine, and my car turned on. <laughs> That's not a tech priest. <laughs> That's a type of seal. I I think I heard the iffy door open. Audio is live. Fuck you. We all go a woo. Will if you appear? I don't know. Ooh. Try it. Ooh. No, no. You all have to do it. Yeah, not now. Meow, meow. Oh, damn, man. <laughs> mean. <laughs> All right. Speaking and... of tech priests, now I'm now I'm thinking, why the hell don't I play Ad Mac? I'm like, come on. I don't just know why don't you don't want to enjoy a hobby. That's your job. Thank you. <laughs> a jobby. <laughs> I mean, you're not Sorry. wrong. Also. God damn. <laughs> I say that as an IT person who plays admin. Can can mm -hmm. we just real quick re or uh, discuss the fact that if he said jobby and it just sounds dirty? I I was honestly trying to pretend it didn't happen. Well, you're on the wrong channel for that. Yeah, fuck. I just didn't get it, so I just kept I moved on. <laughs> 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 I got it, sadly. <laughs> I know what if he was sadly. going for a hobby that is your job. Yeah, the Hobjobby. Why is that worse? 
<laughs> I mean, uh, I, don't I don't know. I don't know. Working in IT would be kind of better if we had admec rituals attached to it. Wait, are you no, not I'm... doing admec rituals when you do your job? Sounds like a skill issue. You even IT? Like, you kidding me? You're supposed to have some way of appeasing the machine spirit to get the computers to work properly. Hmm. I've sacrificed my non-existent firstborn so many times. <laughs> you know, eventually they're gonna come, or they're gonna come for the payment. Yeah, but if I never have a firstborn, then it doesn't matter. <laughs> so this, this, is you have you. The, this is where you have the <laughs> bet the fey your firstborn, then have your firstborn with the fey. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's exactly where I was going to go with that, but um, in let's just say more <laughs> colorful words. Hmm. Uh, it just means I have time to conspire against you with the snakes. I'm not gonna lie, as a fey, I don't see how things could be more colorful. All right. So I'm going to be eating my ice cream, but we are You're going to be, be eating ice cream, but if he don't make me come in there. <laughs> now then. Okay, fine. Conspire with Albus then. Last session, you all had arrived at the city of Ith'un and signed up to be adventurers. You looked at a few of the jobs, and you decided to go out on a wolf hunt. Didn't take you long. You managed to uh, clear out the wolf pack fairly easily. And then, one mission caught your attention, called Kane's Trench. A mission where they are willing to pay you for each floor you are able to map out. And they are going to be paying... How is spelled again? What? How is Kane spelled again? C-A-I-N. <clears throat> but they will pay you 200 zenit per floor that you map out. We're going to be rich. That said, you must map out each room. You are also welcome to keep any and all loot you find. Are there any questions about the recap? I got a note from Yoshi or from Ify. I'm eating pepperoni. Sorry, I was I was reading Yoshi's mind and I knew he said no as well. I was gonna make a joke about rogue likes. That what the joke was. Yosh, what are you screaming about? Get out of my head. <laughs> Why? It's so empty in here. <clears throat> Rearranging the furniture, okay? <laughs> Just don't break anything. You mean what after is, the last time? What is there to break? <laughs> I just said how empty it is in here. <laughs> so, you all are going to be leaving Ith'un once you are prepared. Is there anything anybody would like to do to prepare for the dungeon? Eat. Eat, eat's a good one. Eat's a good one. There are plenty of restaurants for you to, to get food from. As well as bakeries. Anything else anyone would like to do? Nothing here. Sanctuary from the chat? Doesn't exist. I think we have to break Yoshi. Again? It's not that hard. 
I thought we just <laughs> did that last Tuesday. Well, it's now Friday, so... <laughs> I'll just sit here and feasibly design a mech and explain it all through physics, and that'll break them. <laughs> Again. At this point, I'll just be, okay, yeah, it's Friday again. <laughs> so I believe, aside from eating, there's nothing anyone wants to do to set up. Uh, I mean, I'm probably going to gather materials for mapping, so like measuring sticks, papers, uh, pens, stuff like that. All right, negligible. Basically, like the food, I'm just going to say that's a negligible amount of Zenit. Uh. All right. Give me one second. This brownie doesn't want to go down. As you leave to head towards Kane's Trench, it is not a far walk. It is maybe a couple hours southeast. The name is quite misleading. As opposed to an actual trench, there is a cave that just says Kane's Trench on a very crude sign above it. It's a trap. <laughs> it's my trap. <laughs> The funny thing is, I feel like it is a trap, but, but Rex would not know anything about it. <laughs> Van just sitting here like, this is a poorly named trap, Rex. Like, I don't know what a trench is. <laughs> that is not a trench. I don't know what a cane is. <laughs> in death <laughs> so anyway with that please place yourselves at this stairway marching order now I I fully understand that in Fabula Ultima they say not to worry about a dungeon map Bonk. But I like dungeon maps. They help me visualize things. So walking into this cave, it doesn't take long for it to turn into a very narrow hallway. A very long, narrow hallway. And you come to your first intersection really quickly. Check those corners. I'm going to change the music to something a little more fitting real quick. Go, Go with this one. Mother who can't hear the music. Did you turn Dusty down? Do you have Dusty <laughs> muted? I don't think I do. Double check. Oh, I do. That wow. would do it. Yosh doesn't want to hear Dusty. How dare. No, nah, it's fine. I, I, I know why. It's because on Sundays I have Dusty in the chat as well. And I said, go ahead and Bye. mute him so you don't have to deal with him. I probably just forgot to unmute. I just leave him on on Saturdays. <laughs> Van's like, fuck it, I'll listen to Dusty He might have something interesting to say I gotta watch out for the arson Oh so my those god, are the there's a shark following us He's <laughs> on the block there, I'm sorry So those are your paths to follow Which way would you like to go? 
Yeah. Is it bad that Reed thought about going downstairs and finding a pad of graphing paper and actually drawing a map like old school D&D? No. Is it bad that I want to run the opposite direction? <laughs> kind of, Don't yes. Don't make me get the baby leash. <laughs> He'll do it, too. Yep. You're the one who forgot it. <laughs> All right, so is the consensus over this direction that Akaikios is in, or? Uh, looks like it. We're going to the right. All right, you are coming to your... room with no other exits. <laughs> you are There's coming to your first is... room. I'm just piling these all in front of Swifty. I don't know why I'm looking at this, and in my head so, I'm hearing that I should say knee. All glad saying, this is not an IRL table, back, because back. I would absolutely bap those like a cat. Just saying. I know you would. So with that, as you guys enter into that room... Oh, I knew I forgot to grab something. Oh, well. I thought that was a rat. We'll just go with this one. Why not? All right, there's four of them. Yes. Okay, perfect. As you enter into this room, you notice four shambling undead start to walk towards you. Well. Yeah, they weren't kidding about this place. It's really been left in a shambles. <laughs> Can we just walk away? <laughs> I mean, I, I fucking guess if you want to, they are going to be following you. So if you <laughs> run into something a little more dangerous than them, you're probably going to be in trouble. <laughs> just, just break the ceiling in front of the door so they can't get it <laughs> and then move. Is it dropping to it's a save ink because that's no longer a room we have to map. It's good business. Ah, <laughs> uh, you all, y'all, y'all. Hey, I'm smart. <laughs> I'm iffy. You are iffy, and nobody can take that away from you. Not with that attitude. You say that like I would want to. I don't know. I, Maybe I, you want all the iffy for yourself. I, I do want all the iffy for myself, but, but not in a way that you don't get to be iffy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to move into some combat very early on into this. Into this fourth episode. You guys have my rule initiative? I mean, you've rolled it almost every other episode. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it has been literally every episode. <laughs> but that's about the only positive, positive uh, initiative modifier, I think. Yeah, considering mine's the second highest at zero. <laughs> to be fair, Akaikios is wearing very heavy armor. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's what is it? Dex and insight. Yes, dexterity and insight. If you pass, if the rest of you pass a 10, you will give Yoshi a plus one, or you will give him one plus whatever your bone or your uh, bond with there him is. Go. Nope. So, Alice, what do I do? What'd you roll? Snake eyes. Oh. Why did I tell him what I rolled? You five. fail. That's what happens. You you guys will not go first. Well, it's a good well, thing. I guess. It's a good thing I'm behind everybody, I guess. Yeah, it's a good <laughs> thing Akaikios is up front. Mm -hmm. Although, to be fair, all three of us should be pretty tanky, except me, who takes 20 damage the first time every time. So the first zombie is going to run <laughs> up, and it's immediately going to try and rake you, Akaikios. Point of order? I thought it was a skeleton. 
I apologize. These are zombies. Are they soldier zombies? No, they're just zombies. I just in my <laughs> in my haste, I forgot to grab a zombie uh, token. I have skeletons and I have something else that you'll be in, running into in here. One day, one day, I will, my my bonus will take effect. <laughs> Which one? I get five extra damage to soldier soldier rank enemies. Oh. <laughs> oh no, these yeah, are soldier. Me... These actually, let me let me check the book. Because <laughs> soldier, I know what soldier is. It's a very specific rank, and I think these might be. Uh, let's see. I gotta find it now. Hold on. Index, tell me where to look. Tell me your secrets. I will look too. I also have the book. <laughs> uh, what was it called? Okay. Uh, yeah, this is, uh, these are soldiers. Are they? Yeah. Cool. That means I hit harder. Yay. <laughs> Yay! Anyway, a Kaikios. Yes. This this zombie moves forward and it attempts to rake you with its claws. Will a mm -hmm. nine rake you? I'm pretty sure not. It will not. All right. It just can't seem to claw through this armor that that you have in front of or that you have on you. And with that, <laughs> it is y'all's turn. So who would like to go first? I say we just go in order of how we're standing. Works for me. <laughs> All right, Akaikios, you're first. All righty. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. What is the roll on... I can't turn the page on my character sheet for some reason. Really? Yeah. Like it disappears when I mouse over it. Let me do it. All right. Well, then you have done it. <laughs> uh, I am going to spend my two grave tokens. Okay. Which will not cooperate with me. Sounds about right for tabletop Sam. And cast Drain Vigor on all of the zombies. Okay. For an 8 plus 7 is 15 against magic defense. That'll hit their magic defense. All right. They take. 23 dark damage, ignoring resistance, immunity, etc. Okay, you said 24? Uh, 23 each. 23? Okay. I was about to laugh. I'll have you know that now. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I think with right. HP they have now. <laughs> you pull the this essence from them this dark cloud pulling off of them and draining what life force they have as they all take this damage. Anything else? That's it. All right. This next one is going to come forward and try and rake you. Don't do it. I'm so cool and funny. Uh-huh. Don't do it. You're not a leaf. Uh, that is a 20. 
hit. That'll do it. You will take 16 points of physical damage as they are, or as this one just runs over and starts clawing in and manages to get between those those plating or the plating that you use for armor. Mm -hmm. And with that, get between the plates. It is the party's turn. Which, going by what you said before, would be Yoshi's turn. Yep. Uh, so Gabon is going to stab forward over uh, Akakios' shoulder with the spear and hit the green one. <laughs> All right, go for it. I need to find my dice. My you got him in the dice tower. Uh, the one you, and, tower. you and your Rick rolls. I'm on the wrong side of the table again. <laughs> I'm like, where's my dice? <laughs> I need to stop rotating my screen so I can actually oh, see where yeah. my stuff is. <laughs> wow. That's a seven to hit. That will not hit. I am not really well tonight. <laughs> Which is just hilarious to me. Purple one doing... is going to kind of run through and just kind of reaching past the Kaikios. We're going to be scratching at, uh, oh god, what the fuck? Is somebody messing with the core book? I'm not. No. No? That was weird. I forgot the core book was up here. <laughs> that was so weird, the core book just vanished. Like, from my screen. It. I'm sorry, I ate hmm. it. I'm glad they were back up. We're, we're, really having, tasty. we're having weird tech issues tonight, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> so you were saying about those tech priests. Well, look, I haven't done my ritual yet. So, uh, anyway, Gavon, the zombie reaching past the Kaikios, that is an 11 to claw at you. 11 to claw at me? Mm-hmm. Uh, physical? Yes. Nada. All right. Between, between trying to reach past the Kaikios and just your good armor... The zombie is just unable to get to you. Rex. Ah, I'm going to attack this guy. Because it's easier than trying to run past both of the big people. <laughs> That's fair. Okay. I got to find my dice again. I ate them. They were yummy. It's Are they true. Blue? Are they blue raspberry? Because they're blue. Actually, there were uh, wild berry. The tower. Yeah. Eight, and I need a ten. If he, I got a question for you. Was wild berry one of your favorite flavors of pop tart because it was purple and blue? Um, I don't eat a lot of pop tarts. Oh. No, I got a six. So I, no. <laughs> yeah, so that will not connect. I got the exact same roll twice in a row. Oh boy. This is. This is not turning out good for us. <laughs> I just realized I've been calculating my defense wrong this entire time. Oh. Yeah. How, How many times should you have died? Uh, actually, no, it's higher than it. I had it. <laughs> What'd you fuck up? Um, I forgot about the defense boost for my weapon. <laughs> only when you shield, or only when you have the spear and shield. I know. Anyway. With Rex's uh, failed attempt. You know what? Just dogpile on a Kaikios. It's not like these things Do are it. intelligent. Do it, cowards. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're fucking dogpiling you. All right. So, Akaikios, that is a 19 to hit. Yeah, that'll do it. Takes 17 points of damage. Okay. All right. Swifty, it is... It is... Uh, my brain has completely forgotten Alessandra's name for a moment. Ah. It is Alessandra's turn. <laughs> okay.
So. 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 Oh, oh, right. I need to get my actual updated character sheet. Now. Where are you? <clears throat> okay. So, zombies. 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 Uh, zombies. Uh, song stuck in my head. Zombies. Mm. Look at all these zombies to hit. <laughs> so many of them. Mm hmm. So little time. Where is Leon Kennedy when you need him? Uh, probably being oblivious to a woman wanting him. I was thinking Alice. <laughs> So, like, 80% of the female population. Exactly. <laughs> and about, you know, 15% of the male population. <laughs> I would put it closer to 20. So, we've got a lot of zombies on our hands here. It's true. I'm going... To... Okay, so I'm back here. The zombies are all here. I think I'm just going to blast it. Blast the one that's closest. So, purple? Well, it's between purple and blue, whichever whichever one of these guys. So, yeah, let's go. With, well, I probably have more line of, line of sight to the blue. If I would say pur purple is the one that's reaching past the Kaikios, so that's why I was ah. saying purple. Okay, okay, yeah, let's do that then. All right. All right. And so, blasting, because it seems like our damage is kind of low to this time around. Yeah, just a little bit. <clears throat> so, wouldn't be anyway. hit something. Explicit insights. That is a nine to hit. A nine to hit that will hit. Yeah. Hey! All right. That's 10 damage. All right. And which one was that to again? Purple. All right. Sounds good. Purple has been struck by your uh, blasting wand. <laughs> It is, however, going to continue trying to reach past the Kaikios because it has decided it wants to eat Gavon. I don't no, know no, why no. it has decided to eat Gavon, but it has decided to eat Gavon. I assume Gavon's the biggest of us, so... <laughs> that is a 15 to hit Gavon. That is 14 points of uh, physical damage. 13 points, got it. 
as it rakes through and manages to actually get a solid, a solid grab on your side near where your uh, near where your breastplate meets your hip. Who is up on your team? Uh, is it back to me? It is top of the order, so anyone goes. Uh, we can get the team order. All right. I will take a swing at purple. Just a regular old swingy swang. Swingy swang? Actually, you know what? No, I'm going to do uh, drain vigor, but just with the one target. Okay. Boop, ba, boop, ba, boop, doop. That is a six versus magic defense. That is unfortunately not high enough. Rip. As you attempt to to wrestle this life force from it, whatever necromatic magic has this zombie still still shambling seems to be clinging to that cloud, pulling it back into the zombie. Mm -hmm. uh... Time for the Akaikios dog pile. <laughs> Yay! Dog pile, I love it. <laughs> That is a 16 to hit. That'll hit. 14 points of damage. I feel like we've got a we've got a crisis to Kaikios. Yes, I am now officially crisis. Yeah. And it is have actually been crisis. The none of them have been put in a crisis. Would it be a midlife crisis? No, that's what you're going through. Even though you're only a quarter of the way there. Just because I want to get a muscle car. <laughs> so if we're continuing the same order, that would be Gavon. Yep. Uh, and Gavon, it is going to attempt to... Which one Claude me? It was a purple? Yeah. And Gavon's going to return the favor. Have at the fiend! <laughs> Come on, dice! Don't fail me now! Oh, they're gonna fail you now. <laughs> they didn't even go to the dice tower. Yosh, you failed the dice there. I feel like your dice should fail you just because you failed them. <laughs> well. Uh, that will be an 11 to hit. That will hit, unfortunately. <laughs> unfortunately? <laughs> I was rooting against you because you failed to put them into the tower. 12 bolt damage. 12 bolt damage. This one is officially in crisis as you strike it with your spear and the thunder rings out through the hall. Not loud enough to give anyone tinnitus, but definitely uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. Boom. I believe that is all for Gavon. Correct. And we continue the dog pile on a Kaikios. Yay! I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh boy. Die. Uh, that is an 11 to hit. Uh, what happens if it ties my defense? That is a hit. Then it hit. All right. So you are going to take, believe it or not, another 14. <laughs> God damn. I keep rolling nines. This is the first time I'm not the first one to be almost dead. You know, I think these things couldn't hit you, Van, because they can't deal 20 damage. <laughs> so what you're saying is we need to park Van up front. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Uh, with that, speaking of Rex, it is your turn. Oh, Evasion right. tank, go. Yeah. I will do an attack, and I'll tell you what the attack is, depending on whether it hits or not. <laughs> Okay, there, there's that one. Where's my 10? Need these two. Give me these two. Give me the dice. It's uh, 18 to hit. 18 to hit will fucking hit. This is on purple? Yes, I'm going to hit purple. Okay. I'm going to... Smack the crap out of purple with my iron knuckles, which is going to be uh, 21. 21 points of damage? Yep. 
Fucking, so Rex just runs up and just clocks the zombie across the jaw. The Punch jaw the just, zombie in the face. The <laughs> jaw just pops off and the zombie's like, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> It is it is still alive. It's just very uncomfortable. <laughs> it is very close to being dead again. <laughs> the best part is I, I would run up on all fours, jump, and punch it in the face. <laughs> <laughs> and we go for a Kaikios once more. Yay! And we've got a 12 to hit. That'll do it. For 13 points of damage. Now we get to find out what a thing does. I need to do a quick skim. Oh, are you unconscious? <laughs> yes, but no. Oh, oh, you have a special thing. <laughs> you have a thingy thing thing. <laughs> Kaikyo uh -huh. just stamps foot. Last stand. Second wins. <laughs> it's not as much as I would have hoped, but those go away, and I come back with four hit points. <laughs> <laughs> it really is last stand. <laughs> All you have to do is quickly kill one, and you get second wind. <laughs> well, Swifty, it is your move. Mm. Keep hitting the purple one. Yeah. I need the grave points. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna blast the purple one again. Go for it. Do it. I believe. Since I'm... I have a feeling I hit the only time I'm gonna hit this entire round. <laughs> that is a six to hit. That will unfortunately not hit. Rip. Shit, and I was just about to wisecrack about being the only one that's actually hitting shit tonight. <laughs> See, and that's the problem. Me. You started getting cocky. Now purple is going <laughs> purple is going to try and claw Rex's face off for, you know, punching its jaw off. <laughs> so Rex, as as you're like getting ready to punch this thing again, just <laughs> as it slams down a claw towards you. That is a 19 to hit. I mean, yeah, that's going to hit. You're going to take 15 points of physical damage. Well, we broke the curse. <laughs> For now. <laughs> what are we going to do when something that can do 20 damage comes out? It's going to do an extra five. That's good. It's going to keep going five less because because the curse is going to be reversed now. Perfectly balanced, as all things should be. <laughs> all right. And now, with that, it is somebody on y'all's turn. I would like to inventory points a health potion, please. <laughs> <laughs> valid. Fucking valid. Will anyone stop a Kaikios? Please don't. I know, okay. <laughs> <laughs> How much do I get from that, and how many inventory points is it? Uh, it's three for fifty, isn't it? With that, uh, it should be on the sheet somewhere. Apparently, it's not. I can learn how to spell a little elixir because that's the healing thing. Yeah, wait. Remedy is fifty. Is three points for fifty hit points. Three points for fifty hit points. Bet. And does that take my turn to do that? Yes. Okay, then that is what I have done. All right. Well, it's time, Akakios. Are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> Oops, I failed. I rolled them off. Well, your dice should fail you. <laughs> they did not. That is a 14. <laughs> Oh, yep. no. All right. How much do I take? 17. Apparently, apparently, Tabletop Sim has gone, you know, 
I'm told you roll really well when you're GMing. So we're just <laughs> going to make it happen here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Look, chat can see all of my rolls. All I'm going to say, it's time for the pro tags. What do y'all want to do, you fabulous misfits? I say we curse Alice for bad rolls. <laughs> 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 yes, we would, we would like to do a ritual to curse the GM's dice. Does anybody in chat know how to do how to do dice curses? <laughs> Anyone in I chat? Can, good I can probably figure one out, but <laughs> yeah, except you're in a Monday game with me, and we just lost our killer. So you want me rolling as good as possible? True. Yeah, we are <sighs> so screwed. It's fine. I have, I'm a I'm an arcanist. I have AOE spells. If I use a fucking thing. <laughs> Not talking I mean, about I my just, mythic point usage. I just need to be too angry to die. <laughs> anyway, uh, so if we're continuing what we have done, Gavon, you're up. Okay. Uh, time to do time to do wacky shit. Time to do some wacky shit. Do da do da. Hope you get away with it. Do that, eh? Okay, so first thing I am doing is I am going to stab Mr. Purple again. Go for it. Uh, that will be a. I need to do math here because it's a bonus for this. Uh, that'll be an eight to hit. An eight will hit. Okay, it takes three damage. Uh, sorry, five full damage. All right, it is dead. Awesome. Uh, I now lose ten mind points. All right. And I'm not done. Okay. Akakios, take a hit at something. Yeah. Anything. <laughs> so you... No, you stab into purple and it just explodes into viscera as as a Kikios guided by your your shout murder, swings murder, for murder. which one? Murder. Uh, mm -hmm. Whatever the next one is in order. Uh, a seventeen. To hit. To your, you have a plus three to your accuracy roll, but your high roll counts as zero for damage. Twenty to hit. <laughs> all right. Uh, uh, that, green. All right. How much damage? Uh, if my high roll is zero, 14. All right. Solid amount of damage, putting it right into crisis. Woo! So I'm nice still not nice. done. Oh, God, oh, no. he's still he's still going. Can't stop, won't stop. Uh, now I'm going to grab Rack and throw him at Blue and say, Rack, strike! <laughs> Yeet the child! All right, where well, we got the fastball special? <laughs> Is this the thing where he gets to you, or where he uses his turn now? Yep. Okay. Queen's Gambit is amazing. <laughs> well, I I got a nine to hit. A nine will hit. And which one did you awesome. eat him at? Blue. Blue. All right. How much which damage? Does Sixteen damage. Another one put in a crisis. As you get fastball special <laughs> and just clock this one in the torso. Part, a solid chunk of it comes with your hand. Makes sense. However, however it does not smell appetizing <laughs> even to Wreck. It's it's dull. Oh. Wreck has, has partaken in rotten meat before and he's not good. <laughs> he remembers the stomach ache. <laughs> All right, uh, let's see. Eeny, meeny, miny, blue is going for Rex. Uh, that is an oh, 18 to hit Rex. Yeah. That is 15 points of damage to you. Let's see. Which is still not quite in crisis. <laughs> and now we move to Swifty's turn. Y'all eventually yeah. I'll be good about moving the fucking the sheet that's on display. 
Okay, so blue's still left, eh? Uh, blue's still left, green's still left, pink's still left. Pink is so the anyway. Pink has taken the least amount of damage. So anyway, I'm gonna blast blue now. Go for it. That's a 10 to hit. That'll hit. And that will be... I think 11 damage. All right. Yep. So you blast into blue following up Rex and you mm. make a solid connection to it. Uh, is that damage while in crisis? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, let's see. Now I have to think because... Purple went, Kaikios went, then one went, then Gavon went, Jack went. Okay, so there's just pink left. Got it. Pink! A Kaikios, or a Kaikios, pink wants you. Okay. Everyone wants me. I'm desirable. It's true. Uh, fuck, that is a 19. Pink really wants you. As as usual, go on. Seventeen points of physical damage. These zombies are tearing at you as much as they can. And I'm in crisis again. <laughs> oh no! Oh. oh boy! And we're back to the top of the order, where blue is going to go for Rex. I have a feeling I'm about to go in the crisis. <laughs> Yeah, probably. That is an 18. Yeah, no, I'm more than in 17 now. points of damage. Let's see, yep, I, I'm, I'm way below crisis now. <laughs> oh. All right, uh, it is y'all's turn. Uh, I can do funny cast spell on everyone again. <laughs> I don't see why not. Uh... I can heal one person. Well, let me see if this heals me before you pick. Okay. Because if this does go off, it'll heal me for a significant amount. All right. That is 11 versus magical defense. That'll hit all of their magical defense. Or da, 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 another 23. All right. Blue perishes. Let's see. Green is still alive. And pink is still alive. But pink is officially in crisis. Alice, what is 22 divided by 2 times 3? Oh, 33. 33. 33. Thank you. Plus You're 24 welcome. is? Uh, 57. Okay. You're welcome. All right. <laughs> you literally rip the life from one of them as the other two struggle to contain what little unlife they have. They're just drying up into, like, withered mummy husks. Uh, let's see. Uh, eeny, meeny, miny, green wants a kaikios. I am pretty wantable. It's true. Hmm. They're also at the front of the line. That is a 13 to hit. That'll do it. 16 points of damage. I have been rolling ridiculously well. This is kind of kind of weird. I am only alive by the power of necromancer bullshit. <laughs> it's true. 100% true. Uh, I believe, Gavon, you are going? Uh, give me a second. We'll sleep. Okay. Why is the Blahaj on top of the tower? Not even finished yet. Because it goes where it wants. Okay. Uh, so you healed successfully, right, Akakius? Yes, I am healed. Okay, cool. Uh, we're Queen's Gambling again. Okay. Hmm. Come on, Yosh, I believe in you! 
Uh, Is your dice tower going to work? There it goes. There it goes. <laughs> I, I helped. Okay, yeah, that's a 42 to hit. That is your maximum fucking roll, too. So, uh, yeah, obviously that hits. Uh, that's five bulk damage to pink. Okay. And then Rax heals, uh, where's the equation at? Uh, ten hit points. So I can survive one attack. <laughs> yeah. Better than nothing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you get one. <laughs> Still only counts as one. <laughs> All right. Uh, both of them have actually gone at this point, so. Rex, you are up. All right, I am angry. Uh, but the one who attacked me is dead, I think. <laughs> so. Yep. It had its soul ripped from its body as it was standing in front of you. Let's see. So that is a 17 to hit a uh, green. That will hit. Okay, so that's uh, 20 damage. Fucking overkill, bro. <laughs> and I, this time I'm not just going to punch it. I am going to grab it and try and rip it in half. <laughs> <laughs> so you just you grab it and between your anger and just your sheer latent abilities, you don't rip it in half, but you start tearing it to bits. It is kind of disturbing to watch. <laughs> Alessandra. Mm, well, it's been working, so I'm just going to blast the last one then. Do it. Nine to hit. That will hit. 10 damage. All right. You have successfully damaged that zombie. It is still alive. Uh, and at this point, it's going to go for the small defenseless child that's easily accessible and not armored. <laughs> I'm wearing clothes. Still alive? The pink is still alive. <laughs> that is a thing still alive. Yeah, is, that's it gonna what, hit. is it what's still alive? Is it singing still alive? What's singing? Never mind. I don't know what the fuck you... What the hell you smoking? Anyway, yeah, 22 <laughs> will hit. Take 17 points of physical damage. I am almost dead, but I am still alive. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, it's time to beat down on this zombie like they were just beating down on the Kaikios. <laughs> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. The balconing begins. Boobonk. Babonk. Who's turn? Oh, Kabong! It's, it's whoever whoever of you wants to go. It's been you usually first. I'll throw out a drain vigor. See if I can't get a couple more hit points out of him before he goes. Do it. That is 11 versus magic defense. That will hit. 21 damage. That will fucking end it. As as you rip the soul from this thing's uh, corpse. And it drops dead. The battle ends you all a little bit more wary than when you had started. A little more wary. Just just a smidge. Also, I just realized I should have been doing two extra damage because of adrenaline. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, the battle is over. With that, I need to heal. <laughs> I'm sure most... Well, actually, no, it would just be you at this point. Akaikios just healed like 4,000 damage. Yep, it's true. AOE, it's true. With AoE drain life. <laughs> Pretty okay with damage. I'm just gonna... Meanwhile, I'm just dusting myself off back here. What damage? 
I'm just gonna just gonna spend the three points and get fifty HP back. <laughs> Which means I am missing four HP. So what is the plan? We still have other rooms to explore. <laughs> it's true. Ah. <laughs> Let's see. So from here, oh, this one's not locked. Or is it okay? Blahage. I see, I see a box. You do. Just one path you may go. It's a box. Mm -hmm. Am I living in a box? Now, see, Van feels like that box is a trap. <laughs> I mean, it could be. <laughs> But Rex would not know that, would not even think of, of a trap as being a thing that could exist. <laughs> so you've got two routes you can go. Which way would you like to go? Hmm. Well. Kaikyo's gauging which way the child is about to sprint. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, the leash. Loose, loosely holding the leash that Rex hasn't noticed was slipped onto him during the combat. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta go to the box. What's in the, the box? box? What's box. in the box? You don't want to know what's in the box. Wouldn't you like to know? It's a box. <laughs> It's the blockage. The blockage. The blockage is in the box. The blockage is in the box. <laughs> it's a pocket dimension that holds only. It's blockage. the blockage in the box. <laughs> blockage in a cardboard box. It's a pocket dimension holding blockage. Well, just infinite blockage. Oh no! They're adorable and evil. Oh no! Not again. <laughs> hey, what, what do you mean not again? To, to be this to be called evil. <laughs> Wait a minute, time out, question. Answer. Are these Poths here to take their revenge on Link? Look, they might be. Okay, which I'm one not, of you is Link? So I'm I not going to tell them how show. to live their life. <laughs> <laughs> which one which one is which one of us is Link so I can hide? I would say I would say, I would say it would be up. you, the child who doesn't really speak and has elf ears and a fairy. I mean, but I also don't use a sword. <laughs> and Link doesn't always use a sword. Link also doesn't punch things. <laughs> he does when he's not being a coward. So, never. <laughs> As you all walk into this room, kind of making sure you start to get the dimensions, I'm going to move you all in here a little bit more. It is at this point. Are they really not link like they're supposed to? God damn it! Like at this point, we fight. We find the pots from Elden Ring. And as you begin to survey the room, and you notice these pots, you notice an eye glaring at you, and you realize that these things are sentient. And as with that, we are going to roll another initiative. I have to remember where my dice are. Am I rolling the initiative this time or not? I don't think they're going to change it now. You are the only one that has a positive modifier. <laughs> it increases our chances of at least success. Uh, I am one away from ten. Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> are we going to continue the trend of Yoshi getting no bonuses from the party? No bonus from me. 
I rolled over Let's 10, see. but armor big. <laughs> <laughs> it was like, I rolled over 10, but I have a negative 40. <laughs> I rolled a 9, ooh, I have 0. Ooh. ooh. <laughs> Ooh, what, what what is what is the what is the modifier on the initiative roll? It's a dex plus insight plus what? Uh your what armor will you? your armor will have an initiative bonus. Because I have a I think I should have a bond with Yosh. Yeah, but your bond gets uh, added to his roll, not yours. Ah. Uh, okay. Yeah. I mean you can spend a fabula point and have it happen. Wait, you do have wait, seven. I do have seven. I have an idea, maybe. But you can also just let him roll and see what happens. What happens if? Okay, so what do I do if you if you want to use a fabulous point again? Uh, you have to tell me how you're planning on using it, and then we will uh, workshop it to make it work if possible. Well. I want to invoke I, my straight with Gavon to cheer him on. So yeah, I will that. also. I will also invoke my point to cheer him on. Like, you got it this time. <laughs> All right. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna be spending that to give yourself a bonus equal to your bond to him. Yep. So that puts what me. You, that puts that me at ten. That puts me at 10 as well. But you have a minus yeah. 2 to your initiative modifier, Swifty. Oh, shit. So, so don't, tell you. don't worry about spending that. I spent okay. mine because I also get 5 HP back if I spend mine. <laughs> okay. So, uh, Yosh, you will have a plus 2 because of Van. Okay. Uh, that puts us a total of 9. 9 total? Now, yep. Let me check these things initiative. All right, you guys will have the priority. <laughs> woo! Woo! I love nice. being able to hear Ify like a full fourth of a second before she comes through on Discord. <laughs> echo! Echo, echo. All right, echo. so who would like to go first as these pots are staring you down? Don't do pot, kids. Mm. Say, say no to drugs. Don't Especially do kids, pot. Also good <laughs> advice. <laughs> I love how sassy the Dreadurns look in the fucking book. They're just sassy bots. Yeah. Yeah. They just they have well, the sassiest fucking picture. Now here's mm -hmm. the question that might help us determine who goes first. Who would have seen the pots first? Um, let me just take a quick look at everyone's sheets. The I'm child's pretty sure it's probably be... hissing at them. I'm going to say I probably wasn't the first one to see them because Rex is not very observant. <laughs> Wait, what happened now? Hmm. I was saying whoever who would have whoever would have seen the pots first should go first. <laughs> uh, it's not yes, Rex. I guess Rex... in the middle of the room. Rex could be in the middle of the room and would not have seen anything. <laughs> Do you guys realize that, like, so far every sheet I've looked at has the same, like... Okay, so Swifty has the highest dex insight, so I will say, Swifty, you are the one who notices the pots moving around. Um, okay. <laughs> oh my god. I, I just figured that would, be the mo that, would, that would be the most thematically correct. Whoever sees it first should do something first. I'm perfectly fine with that if that's what the party wants to do. That's just my suggestion. I'll with that. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm just going to reflexively blast the red one. All right. So I started blasting. So anyway, I started blasting. So you all watch as like. Video. You're looking around this room. Gavon's writing everything down. Rex is sniffing a wall. Kaikios is watching around. And you just see as El Alessandra blasts at a pot. Alessandra, roll. Let me correct you. I Rex is sniffing the box. <laughs> oh, there, there's no box. That's that's for my own sanity. Nine. 
Okay, well, he's sniffing the spot where the box would be. <laughs> you you fire off a blast, and it just bounces off the shell of this of this pot. Hmm. So you hit the pot. Dude, ah. that was like against magic defense, right? No, that's against their normal defense. Yeah, it's a physical blast. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Yep, Swifty and I uh, talked about that weapon very specifically. <laughs> gotcha. So as uh, that happens, you just you hear a cacophony. <laughs> uh, Swifty, I'm going to be rolling against you. Oh, shit. Uh, let's see. So we're going to not be using D12s anymore, thankfully. Because that was just fucking mean. So against your magic defense, that's probably not going to hit with a four. No, it's not. As the cackling, no, not. the cackling kind of rings into everyone's ears, primarily into into Alessandra's. You all realize that these urns are alive and want you dead. <laughs> Who's next? You know, I literally heard you take the pot's turn, and then I thought you didn't take the pot's turn. <laughs> and I'll have you know out of respect or out of respect I'm keeping the cackling to not be my usual cackle well, Although I am, I I am I curious if the fucking dice rolls are going to uh, reflect that I guess I'll rush at the p- green one alright go for it rawr rawr <laughs> I mean, I can't speak to it because it's it's a monster type, probably not a beast or a plant. So, but I can it, is, to, I it is it is an undead. I can't talk to undead, but I can talk to monsters. <laughs> I mean, you can talk to undead. It's just, do they listen? That's the question. That's true. Answer is no. Me, they don't give a shit. Let me let me see if I can smack the crap out of this thing. Or if all my rolls were wasted in the last battle. Really? You were on a 10, then you hit the other dice and rolled over. <laughs> that's a mid. That's not going to hit. That's a 6. 7. That's a 7. Not- <laughs> yeah, so you you try and smash the pot, and it's just very sturdy. Kind of hurts a little bit. Negligible. I mean, for I said smack it, I was trying to backhand that pot. <laughs> and it did not work. Do Rex is sitting there surrender. doing that. Rex is di- sitting there doing that hand wavy thing. The back of his hand is just bright red. And he's like, All right, y'all. Should should I try the actual cackle? See if it reflects in the dice rolls. Only if it reflects negatively. <laughs> <laughs> All right, give me a sec. <laughs> oh. Rex, as you're shaking your hand the pot in front of you a single eye peering through that black crack in it <laughs> I just well, scared I the shit the out thing. of I just scared the shit out of Revo <laughs> did I wait did I cut out you sure did yep <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> you know that is an 8 to hit uh, Rex uh, that will not hit. That's certainly better than I rolled before. Unfortunately, I blame the fact that I cut out. <laughs> As the cackling is coming through. <laughs> uh, it is up to your group. Uh, you can if I go? Go for it. By the way, for context, Revo actually whimpered to my cackle. Oh my god, what did you do to her? I cackled. I thought I was clear. Okay, Revo. So, Gavon, what's your move? It's a move. Show me uh, your move. <laughs> I'm going to advance on the blue one. All right. And attempt to stab it in the eye. Do it. Come forth, beast, from your hiding. 
I thought you said bam, and I was like, you're not Nightcrawler. <laughs> bam, bam. That is such a weird teleport sound. <laughs> I I think I know what sound they were going for though, and they just didn't know how to explain it. That will be a twelve to hit. A twelve, you say, against physical? Yes. yes. That will hit. Okay, and so that's gonna be how much damage again? That's you going do. to be ten bolt damage. Ten bolt damage? Okay. And that's blue? Yes, blue. blue Alright. Your, your spear makes contact and the, the thunder break or runs through the room. Unfortunately, the spear doesn't even really like pierce like it doesn't make a bigger crack in this thing than it did or than it already had in it. Uh it is now going to and I'm gonna be trying not to peek out the microphone. Revo, I will be cackling. <laughs> Look, I have to give her the warning now. Yep. As as it looks up to you with its its single eye and just <laughs> Did I did I did I cut out oh, or did yeah. it come through? I nearly I, peeked I, out. I, I caught like the tail end of that. At some point I need to just I need to clip me cackling and put it on my soundboard. Uh that is yeah. a ten to hit. Physical? Yeah. That'll be a bounce off the shield, bitch. Uh, thankfully, it's six and ups for criticals. Not fives. Wait, what? <laughs> I said, thankfully, it's six and up for criticals, not fives. Unless you're me. Okay, so with that, it is going to be... Uh, it's between Rex and Akaikios. It already went. Rex already went. Oh, it's yeah, yeah. Rex oh, yeah, Akaikios, it's just you. I just Party missed. time. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not used to y'all not or to y'all having the initiative. <laughs> I took the initiative because everybody else Whoop. was taking too long. <laughs> pulling their life. I'm pulling their life. <laughs> Drain them. I will. Maybe nine versus magic defense. And then turn uh, their. <laughs> unfortunately, no. Wow. You, I was gonna say, you <laughs> get into this movie. <laughs> small, like, puffs of smoke come out the cracks in these pots, but it doesn't. It doesn't go far. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. As you're just not able to pull their, their, uh, their life force. And we're back to the top of the order. Who would like to go? Who wants to go first? <laughs> Anyone? I mean, oh, I, I will try blasting again. <laughs> there we go. Up oh, there we go. I was giving it five more seconds, and then nobody said anything. I was going to jump in. <laughs> I missed the dice tower. That would be a 10 to hit. Unfortunately, a 10 just does not pierce through the ceramic this thing is made of. <clears throat> oh, wrong button. Uh, let's see. Eeny, meeny, miny. Red's gonna cackle at Akaikios this time. I feel like I feel like it'd be fun to do that to Akaikios. Are you gonna come oh. cackle at me in my room? You know, it's tempting. But I, I can just splash damage you from my office. Or from my room. It's true, you can. I can I'm actually hear it, at least. I'm enjoying this too much. I'm waiting to get picked up on your microphone. Because I'm just... I think I'm getting progressively louder every so often. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I heard about 0. Well, that is a 3, three so that will miss. Good. Fuck them. <laughs> don't fuck the pots alright who's up Why hey, not? hey we don't kink shame we're not kink shaming it's just what's in these pots I, you don't uh, know maybe it's I, anime figurines what I is, do know what is first, a pot but a first primitive off, jar first off <laughs> no 
Bad. Don't make me get a spray bottle. Secondly, I do know I'm the GM. Spray bottle. Spray bottle. All right. Who on your who in your group is up? Top the order. So, uh, Rack, probably me or Rax or almost uh, the top of the order. I but they already went. So, oh, I should do it right. Uh. You guys want me to do shenanigans with the turn order again or not? Do whatever. Whatever whatever you want. <laughs> uh, I'm asking you guys want me to shenanigans the turn order? Sure, go for it. Uh, no way I'd be leading you astray. Who, who wants their turn order now and who wants just a free attack? I'll take a free attack. I'm fine with whatever. <laughs> uh, okay. We're doing Gambit, then. All right, go for it. Okay, that will be a 14 to hit. That will hit. Which one were you attacking? Uh, blue again. All right. So blue takes five bolt damage. Oh, okay. And then uh, if he, you get the free attack. All right, I will also will, take a swing at blue. You have a plus three to hit, but your high roll cuts a zero for damage. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, that is with the plus three, a 12 to hit. <laughs> that will hit. Oh, thank God. Uh, and 14 damage. 14 damage? Uh, what kind of damage? Uh, well, the fact that you're asking means it's dark damage that ignores invulnerability. Okay. <laughs> Just call me out of my <laughs> shit, why don't you? You said 14? 14? <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so uh, it is officially in crisis. Yay! <laughs> okay, and then uh, Rax gets their turn now. Okay, well, I'm, I'm just going to attack two then. <laughs> Alright, go for it. Which one are you attacking? Blue? Yep, might as well just... Oh. To try and finish it off if I can, which usually doesn't happen because I only got a six. <laughs> uh, yeah, that unfortunately will not connect. I used up all my good rolls last battle. Oh, do we get to double cackle? Uh, yeah, because we uh, got well, no, we got a man, double man, cackle. Man, still gets a turn. double cackle. Yeah, come on over here. Come over here. Reva's gonna cackle with me. Now you gotta make sure man, you put man, still... you gotta put yourself Wait, in. Why is it. double cackle? Alice, why is it double cackle? Only one of them has gone so far. Yes, but no. still one of us to go also. Oh, yeah, you're right. Never mind. Go sit down. <laughs> <laughs> if the Kirby Calvary does not use Vance. <laughs> All right, Cackle, come on. <clears throat> I, I actually I heard you through iffies. The mic be down. So, so good job, Revo. Good job. Proud of you. You've, you've spent enough time in House Sable, you can cackle. Your training is complete. <laughs> oh no, I have been able to do that before I met you. Oh hey, uh, I never said who that was against. That's on me. Uh, we'll go with Gavon, because he just fucking wrecked House. Uh, so Gavon, that is a 14 versus your magic defense. Gavon. Uh, 14 versus my magic? Yeah. But it's a crit, yeah, so it is. doesn't matter. We are going okay, to inflict you... So first off, from their attack, you gain Shaken. Okay, that reduces I cannot hear you over whatever that fucking noise is. I said that reduces my willpower, if I remember correctly, right? Uh, it's whatever's right next to Shaken, <laughs> so yeah, yes. Willpower. Yeah. But, uh... Because your willpower is weakened, you start to you start to dread the fact that you you come to the fact the realization nobody here knows your home. Nobody here talks about your home except for very few people seem to be in the know. And with your willpower being shaken, your resolve being weakened, you feel yourself a bit hopeless. You are gaining the weakened condition as well. Okay. And how much damage am I taking? 
Uh, I will check that in a second. I don't even have to, actually. It's 12. 12 points of darkness damage. 11 points. Got it. Uh, I believe a Kaikios has uh, has a turn left. Yes. What did I do? Your turn. You have a turn. Oh. Your well movie, done. Yugi Boy. Uh, Yugi Boy. Meh. 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 I smack Meh. at the blue. Smack at the blue. Back in the blue. That is an 11. Uh, 11 will hit. Okay. That does 8. 22 uh, special dark damage. 22 special dark. That is going to... Kill off blue. Yay. As you slam your sword into blue, the the urn shatters and Zenit coins start to litter the floor, as well as ash and a little bit of bone. Mm. Uh, was it in crisis before I hit it? Uh, yes. Okay. Token. All right. And with that, I believe we are at the top of the order. Who's going? Uh, might as well be me again. Go for it. Wait, should we be at zero or five experience points? This randomly just occurred to me. Zero. Y'all just leveled up. Five on one. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, hit. You should have five. 16 yeah. to hit. That'll hit. Which one? Red. Okay. And that's 15 that's damage. Thank you. So as as your blast collides into it, you see mm -hmm. like this urn shakes violently. It did not like that. It goes immediately to crisis. Because <laughs> your damage is physical, I believe. <laughs> yes. Yes, it is. Okay. <laughs> Get shattered, nerd. <laughs> yeah, your turn. <laughs> I am I am kind of done cackling. My throat is trying to end me. <laughs> so we are we are going to uh cackle into the mind of Alessandra, polluting okay. her with doubt. Ooh, what what are we what is it? Uh that is a 12 versus your magic defense. And my magic defense is A 12. A 12? So you yeah. are going to take 14 points of damage and you are shaken. Mm. And with that, it is on to y'all. Who's going to go? Uh? Well, I gotta make my dice into a UFO. Wait, what? My dice is going around in circles because I'm making it chase my cursor. Mm. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, I guess I can attack the green one. Go for it. At least hope that my dice let me attack it. Okay, so that's uh crit. That's a crit, I think. That's a, it is a crit, especially for me. <laughs> yeah, it's a double eight. Yeah, that'll that'll crit. Uh, that gives me an opportunity, right? Or yes. Let's see. Let's see which one I want. You know what? I'll 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 just give a Kaikios the plus four advantage. <laughs> I, I don't think anything else would be useful in this exact in this situation. 
<laughs> All right, so Kaikios, your next attack will have a plus four. And then Yay. that's, that's uh, I guess that would be 14 damage because they're not I don't think they're soldiers, so that would just be four. Not a problem. And with that, it is uh, Red's turn, I believe, is the last one. Also, I backhanded this one, and it actually did something this time. <laughs> hey, how much damage did you deal? You never mentioned. Yeah, 14. 14? This yeah. one, you said green? Yeah. As you backhand it, is immediately slapped <laughs> into crisis as, it's, as the urn begins to crack around it. <laughs> Gotta show who's boss. <laughs> these uh, these urns are quite panicked. Uh, anyone else? Is anyone left to go on your side? Uh, they they've both gone, I believe. I went. Swifty went. I don't I've gone this round yet, have I? Yoshi hasn't gone, and I don't. If we, you yeah, no, in. yeah, no, uh, oh. wait, so Swifty gone, Rex, oh, okay, so no, one of them still has an action. So we're gonna go for Rex, why not? I mean, I just, I just smacked it. Exactly, it. so it's gonna <laughs> cackle at you. Uh, well, it's probably not going to, magic defense eight. Nope, just barely not. All right. I'm too busy. Admiring the fact that I just smacked it. <laughs> so with that, now it is all on y'all. It is between all on y'all. Gava or Gavon and a Kaikios. Gava sounds like a type of sugar. Oh my god. <laughs> uh I think I'm gonna take this round if you don't mind. Yeah, go for it. I mean it's basically back yeah. to back. Give me. And who are you attacking, Yosh? Red or green? Uh, green. Okay. Uh, that'll be an 11 to hit. An 11 will hit. You can take my home, but not my honor or my oath! And that'll be a... Yeah. 11 damage, bolt. I mean, technically, oh. they could take your oath, though. And just for the sake of you knowing it, Iffy, that did take damage while in crisis. <laughs> Yay! Yay! I just thought I had to point that out. You technically can take your oath. <laughs> <laughs> now it's time for a Kaikios. One last violence. With my plus four. All right. A plus four brought to you by backhand. And which one is this to? <laughs> Both of them or just one of them? Uh. Oh, I didn't realize there were two left. For some reason, my brain didn't process the red one. Uh, right. Well, I'll hit the green one since that seems like that's what everyone else is piling up on. Oh, okay. 16 to hit. 16 will hit. Uh, 24 funny special damage. <laughs> just like the other one this one shatters coins and ash and bone slamming into the ground and coating around it and with that we are back to the top of the order there's one left it looks terrified okay well Do we want me to do shenanigans one more time to just kill this thing? Let's see. So I am shaken, you say? Yes. Okay. Well, that doesn't affect my blasting. So. Hold on. Hold on. I got to do this. Now you're shaken. Blustered. <laughs> well, that's not going to do anything. Five to hit. <laughs> That will not hit. 
which also <laughs> means that it gets to attack. Oh no! It's gonna go for Rex. Because I'm pretty sure this is the one you hit. I could be wrong. Actually, I'm pretty sure that's the only one I didn't hit. <laughs> Probably. Uh, well, it's only a seven versus your magic defense. So yeah, that doesn't know. All Again, right. Rex is just Rex is just too busy focusing on on the fact that he actually backhanded somebody and it works. Well, with that said, I uh, <laughs> fucking go ham, everybody. I like you've got, ham. You've got three turns. You do delicious <laughs> and I, I got to show you the beauty that is a, a roast made with guinness uh, so i have a i have a question i have an answer do we have do we have ham on us probably not Ham. Yeah. i i have ham i i think we still have ham yeah we still have ham. Right, uh i don't care if i go i mean go for it we don't have ham so i can't do what i was gonna do were, were you just going to curl up and start eating ham? No, I was going to go ham. <laughs> oh, uh, this is axe attack, by the way. Okay. I'm switching to the axe and just screaming in rage at the damn thing. Okay. Uh, what was that roll again? Oh, fuck. That actually is a 14 total. Cool. That hits. Uh, yeah, so that thing's going to be taking uh, math. Uh, 22 bolt damage. All right. With a loud crack, it shatters, spilling the same contents as the other two. The floor now coated in ash, coin, and bone. And combat is over. Woo! I mean, do we recover from conditions at the end of combat or not? No, it's only when you rest. What did we recover at the end of combat? I don't remember. Uh, nothing. Okay. So, for those curious, there is 300, or 200 zenit scattered through, or scattered across the floor. I have to make one note to everybody, and I have to knock on board after I say this. Okay. This is, this is the first combat I didn't take any damage. True. <laughs> You're <laughs> fucked in the next combat. Now, speaking, <laughs> speaking of the next combat, we are going to take our break now. So if you need water, if you need a snack, uh, get up and do so. I personally am going to go grab a NOS because I make decisions. Go have your NOS. So feel free to interact with chat. Chat, the, the ban on chatting is... Well, the ban, the ban on chatting interaction is over for now. So... Feel free to interact as much as you want with them until we start again. Ask any questions. I may or may not have an answer. Probably not. Because I don't ever have answers. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, Anna, we just we just don't interact with chat that much while we're doing the game. Oh. Because we don't want to be distracted from the game. <laughs> I'm going to uh, grab some water, so I'll be right back, guys. Okay. I will also be back. I guess I'll sit here and I'll interact with chat. <laughs> All right, chat, it's just you and me. If you have anything you want to say while they're gone, I will pretend that you didn't say it. <laughs> I don't know. I can't delete the message, but, you know, I, I can still pretend it didn't happen. It is lonely at the top. <laughs> I'll have anything interesting happen? I did. I did. I, I want to tell you guys the ridiculous thing that happened today. So I went to because part of my job makes me go to the courthouse. Um, so I went to the courthouse, dropped off the paperwork, went back to my car, and then my car wouldn't turn on. So. I called my insurance and they called a tow truck Then the tow truck got there, started loading up my car. Then the tow truck broke. So the tow truck had to call a tow truck. <laughs> so we sat there and waited for two hours for the next tow truck to come by to tow the other tow truck. And then the second tow truck driver gets out of his car, looks at me, says, I'm sorry. Let me take a look at your engine. So I pop my, my hood open 
He looked at my engine for about 15 seconds, told me to try again, and my car turned on, so I drove away. <laughs> and the tow truck still had to sit there to get towed. I'm telling you, it's a tech priest. <laughs> you gotta trust tech priests. They know what they're doing. Just, just the funny image of me driving away and watching the tow truck being loaded onto another tow truck. To be fair, I have seen, like, tow trucks towing a tow truck, towing a tow truck, towing a smaller tow truck, towing a car. I have seen yeah, a conga line of fuckery. The funny thing was, the second tow truck driver came in, he was like, I'm gonna tow you first. And then he was like, let me take a look at your engine. <laughs> I don't know, because you can't spell? Am I okay, wrong? What just happened? Oh, uh, Reva's complaining that Swifty's name is too hard to spell, and Swifty's not in chat, so she can't use Swifty's, uh... Swifty's at. And I'm just making fun of her instead of actually helping. I could. I could help, but, you know, it's funnier not to. <laughs> <laughs> Sound it out, Revo. Was it called Swift Crescendo? Swift Crescendo. R E S E N D O? Close. There's a C after the S. I can figure it out. Uh, so, how's everyone? Is everyone having fun? Everybody enjoying it? Does that help when Crescendo is Italian? I mean,. Not with that attitude. You know, I realize we're on a break. We can put on nice, relaxing music. I told the story. Hello, uh, hello. I kept everybody occupied while y'all were gone. <laughs> I I heard. <laughs> huh? Oh, Van was talking about how he was telling the story. Having more ham? I'm glad you like it. Yeah, uh, rule of house sable. If you ever make a roast and you don't start it with a can of Guinness, you're wasting a roast. Just so you all know. Well, Keeps like that roast, shit nice funny. and juicy. Well, I mean, like, things like ham. That, that is a roast. I don't roast ham. <laughs> how do you make it? I don't know. I don't make ham. I, oh, yeah, I was going to say, how the fuck do you make ham, Van? I don't make ham. <laughs> Why am I friends with so many people who don't cook? I cook. I just don't cook ham. If I'm going to make pork, it's going to be boiled pork for adobo. <laughs> I'm Filipino. And I hear we don't the peanut gallery things. back there. I'm Filipino, Alice. We don't we don't roast things. We boil them. That's my <laughs> Look, I may not be Italian, but I cook like an Italian. <laughs> I don't know how to make a reasonable though. amount of food. I know how to make a reasonable amount of food for four times the amount of people eating it. Like yeah, if you, if you grandma. Yep. If you if you go to a Filipino house, pretty much everything has been boiled before it's cooked. <laughs> when we cook chicken, we boil the chicken first to get the fat off, and then we cook the chicken. <laughs> Anna, again, like, I'm just talking, like, ham. Like, if you, you know, if you if you roast a ham or if you roast a turkey, start it with a can of Guinness or two. It is, I promise you, the juiciest it'll ever be. Like, my father has always done that, where he's, where he's, like... All right, so fun, fun fact. So my, my father has always done his roast with a can of beer. Initially, he would use, I think it was Coors Light, because that's what he kept in the house. And then when he met my my current stepmother, she started getting him into Guinness because he had the money to afford Guinness. <laughs> I hear you laughing back there. It's not wrong. Oh, no, we're, we're laughing at Topper. Oh. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so he started using Guinness. And my father said, like, you know, you, you have to you have to do it with Guinness. So I've only ever done that. And I remember I called Yoshi one time. Because he was coming over, we were having what we call the Friendsgiving, where just a bunch of friends got together to, to have Thanksgiving. And I was like, hey, I'm making a ham, but I don't have what I need. Can you pick me up a can of Guinness? He's like, Guinness? 
for ham? I was like, yeah. He's like, you're wasting a can of Guinness? I was like, hold up. Bitch, did you just say wasting a can of Guinness on ham? No, 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 no. You are going to bring me this Guinness, and I'm going to show you the best ham you've ever eaten. Or you're not touching my ham ever again. So, point of order, at that point, I was drinking Guinness fairly regularly at that time. But my point is, you were, like, so convinced that that was a waste of Guinness. And, and I, I was. Yeah. I was proven wrong. Yeah, you brought... I th Let me finish the story, you fuck. <laughs> so he, he comes over, he comes with the Guinness, he brought, like, a four-pack, so I use the one can, I give him the rest. Or no, I use two cans, I give him the rest. And, you know, I make the ham, and I'm serving it, and I give him a piece, I'm like, eat that right now. He takes a bite, and I go, so, is it a waste to get us? He's like, no. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> I don't drink Guinness either. Uh, Kill the bot! Kill the bot! Kill the Rebo, bot! Kill Rebo, the can, bot. I leave, can I leave the sacrifice to the streaming gods to you? Do my sacrifice and why? Look at the chat. Oh, I'm back just in time for a bot sacrifice. Let's go. It's, <laughs> it's true. Goodbye, Tomux LTU. You'll never be better than fucking what? What was it? Fucking. Something I wish. Gynecologist? Yeah, it was something gynecologista or some shit. <laughs> Swifty, yeah. thank you so much for the sub. <laughs> God, I I wish I still remember. Oh, yo, she watched it. Is it in the recap? Because I'm pretty sure that was last episode. I didn't notice it in the recap, but I can rewatch it again really quickly. Nah, well, it's like uh, a 16 minute recap. That was it that long when I watched it? That's what Mick said. Yeah. Mick said it was a six then. Yeah, Mick said it was a 16 minute uh, video. 13 minutes 45 seconds. Okay, 13 minutes 45 seconds. Something to look forward to tomorrow, everybody. I'll be uploading that and letting it go public at noon tomorrow for the recap for episode three. So if you're sitting here like, what the fuck have I missed? Well, there's recaps up on my YouTube. Yeah, we have recaps. Uh, Mick's been doing recaps? Yeah, Mick's been making recaps for us. And he has been doing a fucking top-tier job. Every one of them has been great so far. That's amazing. Yep. Actually, can you... Sh uh, you you won't know how to spell his name. Okay. Oh, wait, they're not in here. Yeah. Um, Mick, is, Mick is either asleep or working. Or both. You know what? Knowing him, it's entirely possible. Make sure you're following Mick. He is he is one of my editors and a really good friend. He's also absolutely insane anytime he's on or he's in the pub. I also can't follow from a shout out on mobile, apparently. That's lame. Yeah, it doesn't really pop up on mobile. That's unfortunate. Allegedly. <laughs> he he does. He does. He goes into NyQuil-induced comas. <laughs> what? But is that actually sleep? I am an insomniac. I am the last person you should be asking <laughs> what constitutes... <laughs> you literally have the queen of naps next to you. Ask her. Ask the fifth. I just did a skip of the recap. I did not catch his name. Anyway. Okay. Damn it. Yeah, it's it's probably in my recently blocked. I I probably. need to know now. I need to know. God damn it, the community demands the information. What information? The the fucking top the tier bot from last time. The top tier name. Oh. Oh, was their account deleted? Because I don't see it. I typed oh no no no! Gynecologista das famosas. Yes, that's it. I just <laughs> noticed it. It's because they spell it with an I instead of a Y. <laughs> it's such a dumb name. It's the perfect name. I'm upset. I have to ban them. That's almost as good as when Baba's name was Babadook the Cum Slut. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, top-tier names here. 
Ah. Well, I've got my NOS. Has everyone got their drinks, their snacks? I know Fifth is still sitting on the bed. Oh, I still need to get a drink. That's what I was missing. Well, I have to go get a gun. I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> so while, while we're waiting, uh, what oh, if everyone got a, a the, gun? <laughs> what, what does everyone think about the amazing names of the American Cricket League teams? I have no idea because I don't. I don't pay. I don't know about cricket. I right, am let, the let Alice me, now. Let, we are. Got... <laughs> Let me, just read the <laughs> yeah, yeah, let me just read the names to you guys. Ready? We have I am not the Los the Angeles Angel. anymore. <laughs> so, so guys, we have the Los Angeles Night Riders. Spelled with a K. Oh, this was actually now, loaded. Fine. Yo. <laughs> we have the New York Miney. M-I-N-Y. I thought I grabbed the unloaded one. We have the San Francisco Unicorns. Okay, that one's actually legit, though. The okay. Seattle Orcas. Okay, okay. That, the that, Washington, D.C. That's, that's Freedom. And the I've Texas worse. Super Kings. So I got a question. Um, when I when I talked to the, uh, the gun, did that get caught on, on uh, microphone? I didn't hear yeah. it, no. Uh, I walked in, and Revo was like, I'm the Alice now, and I just went... Nothing. Damn. Nothing. Here, here, here I'll, I'll, I'll give you a good sound for, for that. Ready, Alice? Go. See if this comes through. I, yeah, I think I hear it. Yeah, but I got, I got the Nerf Centurion. Oh, I know. You hit me by shooting at the wall opposite me. We know I'm the queen of ricochet no. shots. You know this. Hell, you you remember what I did to Benjen, or Phoenix for that matter. Fun fun story before we before we get back to this. Back in college, I um, I had a I I was basically living in my car, even though I lived with my mother. Might as well have lived in my car. All my stuff was there, and I had one of those like stupid little Nerf guns with like the pole thing in the back, and that was how you cock it. Fucking, I had one of those just. Cocked in the back seat. Phoenix is sitting in my back seat. I took a turn really hard. The gun bounced off of his head, hit the window, fired, and hit him in the head. And he's like, "You double tapped my ass without looking or holding the gun." Wow. Your Alice. skill. Hashtag Alice things. Hashtag the nickname used to be long shot for a reason. Yeah. Oh. oh my god. Alright, is everyone back? I think I so. never left. <laughs> well, I know Iffy went into her room. I don't know if it was just a cower from me holding a gun or not. You'll never know. I mean I know now. Shit. <laughs> it's almost like you what spoke. <laughs> No gun shall ever scare you're the You're not man. allowed to run away. You know that. I yes, I am. I can lock the door. But the key is Alex just is above cheating. the door. Alex is cheating. So I could get in. Plus, I know how to pick locks. You know that. I know how to pick locks too. I know how to pick locks too. You just kick them really hard. Come on, Effie. You want to keep me locked out? <laughs> It sounds like I need to. <laughs> Why? I'm not going to go in there and shoot you. That's not what I'm afraid of. <laughs> what are you so afraid of? I cannot legally say it on twitch.tv slash Allison Dusty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so Anna, I am sorry for the splash damage. <laughs> That was not my intention. Oh, I laughed too hard. <laughs> oh, give me a moment. I, I, I also, I can't up. wait. I can't wait for Mick to edit this and just go fucking ballistic in my Discord again. Like Alice did the mommy <laughs> voice. <laughs> <laughs> I think he did that during the fucking second recap he was editing. 
Yeah, he was like, I I learned that Alice has a mommy voice, and I don't know how to do with this. Right? Sit on a table now? <laughs> Van has pepperoni. God damn it, Van, share some. <laughs> I want some pepperoni. Look, I just I just do things while y'all are doing things. I did not want to fuck people. <laughs> I'm sitting here flustering iffy. Swifty and Yoshi are laughing about it. And Van's like, I've got pepperoni. <laughs> table is safe. Table is secure. <laughs> you sure You're right, Kel. See, that doesn't affect me because we're the same person. I know. I'm not trying to affect you. <laughs> no. I'm, just, not I'm not in, I'm not in the self-cessed. No, I think it's just funny because everybody, everybody else... Panics or I, I don't know why it makes me laugh. Every time you do that voice, it makes me want to cackle for some reason. It's because you know me, and you're like, "Shit, what the <laughs> fuck?" <laughs> I guess my true, honestly. <laughs> you have known me for like Christ, twelve Rebo. years. Why? Oh my god, Yoshi! I have a formal request. She can't hear you, but I only have one good ear. Please don't blow it the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> make me trip on flat I mean it can if the table is the flat ground you're walking on. I I trip over my bed every now and again. God. Hell I know people who do nothing but trip over their words. The table is just flat ground that you can I mean I've on. watched I've watched Glitchy trip over air multiple times. Okay, I've Swifty, fallen sitting you're down. the person who ran their head into a door frame. I want to hear you talking. Yosh, Yosh. Oh, if you're Swift, bringing that up. Yosh, Yosh, you can't talk. <laughs> Swifty, I understand your pain there. It's called being tall. Yes. Something Yoshi will never understand. Hannah, I need to point out the fact that she hit her head on the sign that said, Warning, low door frame. Oh, oh, no, you want to sit on the table? I'd like to point out, I, I, I haven't tripped in 20 years. I'm pretty sure I tripped, like, oh, last shit. week. Alice is tripping Actually, for the both of us. Who's taller, Gallifrey or Swifty? Uh, we need to find out. You know what I, You know what this means. Swift, how tall are you? Like 6'1", six 6'2", six somewhere in there. If you're six one, then then Gallifrey is taller because I'm six one and she's taller than me. I'm somewhere in between them, so I don't know. You like table sets? Good to know. I'm taller than you if I stand on your shoulders. I have to pick you up and put you on the table at some point, Anna. <laughs> anyway, we <laughs> <sighs> mean if we stand together on each other's shoulders <laughs> somehow. It's okay. I have very strong shoulders and very strong legs. You can stand on my shoulders. We'll wear a giant trench coat, and then one of us will be taller. Ify, what do you think? Do you think I could lift Anna onto a table? Yeah. <laughs> there you go, Anna. There, there's your official word. <laughs> All right. Let me put the music I back can. so we can so we can get back to. Before we completely lose the plot, yeah. I think that's already lost. I think that's Honestly, already what, gone, yeah. I'm, I'm pretty sure thing? I'm pretty sure Mick is gonna be putting this entire break in there. Hi Mick! This is this is a hello from Alice in the past while you're editing this. Mick, we apologize to turn into the trailer for Bit Time Bandits. <laughs> Mick, this is this is Van from the future coming back to the past to let you know in the present <laughs> that you're not gonna like this next for the past. 20 minutes, you're not going to like it. <laughs> no, he's going to love it. I know, Mick. He's going to really enjoy it. And I said, I didn't say he would hate it. So All right. Like it. <laughs> anyway, so back to this. Y'all are able to uh, move around. There's only one path left to go for now. Wait, so so gonna... Why is the wooden box there on the map? Is it there for a marker that... of some kind? So you'll notice that there's the skeletons on the map as well. Yeah. That is just for me to tell what is supposed to be in these rooms. Well, if there's no chest, why chest icon? Because the That's chest implies room. that there is treasure in there, such as the 200 zenith you found. <laughs> you never told us how much zenith it was. I, I did at the end of it. I might have walked away by then, I'm sorry. 
uh, walking so are we away with that uh, four ways, guys. I mean, you carry all of my money, so. <laughs> Okay, that's fair. So I, I will take half of it that sells for twelve for years and the fifty the other hundred you guys can split, I guess. Okay, how much do we get? Fifty each. Y'all were keeping my money too, so <laughs> Oh, was I? Okay, so I'll take another fifty to put it in the back of oh my god, my belt is gonna weigh so much. <laughs> Let me guess. I see a skeleton on the map, ergo monsters. Yes, ironically. More dead. Well, specifically. Skeletons. <laughs> Boners. Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. That's, Boners. that's right, Ify. There are boners on the map. <laughs> wow. Should we back here? I was just going to say I run past them and run into a wall, but... <laughs> Oh, and I'm pulling out their uh, their counters. All right. So with that, we are going to have you roll initiative oh. as always. Well, give me a second. I just want to check it real quickly. I gotta have my dice. Choice. <laughs> Please. That's what that symbol means. Okay. Ooh, I actually beat a ten this time. Woohoo! Woohoo! Right, like uh, with your bonus, see what you beat it. Yeah, I mean, I almost rolled double eights. So. Oh. <laughs> Twenty-six. And that's another nine. Well, so you're getting eight. That's a seven. So that's a seven on the roll, and then my initiative. No, it's a five. So Ify, uh, Kaikios, do you have the bond? Do, is your bond with uh, issues? Ify's my brain will not fucking work. Is your bond with Gavon? Yes. I think everyone's right. bond is with me. So that's a plus two from <laughs> Ify. Uh, what about you, Van? Did you? No. And Swifty? Um, yeah, I rolled also. a five, so that's not happening. All right, so Yosh, you got a total of 12, then. I need to find these things fucking stat block. Oh, there it is. Oh, these things, by the way, do not count as soldiers. Mm, by the way. Yeah, just so I know. figured. Uh, let's see, so... <sighs> you will have initiative, though. Mm. I like how we went from the smart way to, to for everyone to go in to just Rex leads everybody now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's how it is sometimes where Rex just runs ahead. <laughs> just, okay, so we only see two. Yep. You see two. You see one skeletal uh, person holding a sword and a shield. You see another skeleton that has a staff in their hands. The all of their equipment is very shoddy, by the way. The robes that the uh, stabbed skeleton wears are torn. But who will be going first is the question. Oh, I see Rex. I see Rex has already run straight towards one of them. Rex has slipped the leash again. God damn it. I like to have a picture of Kaikios is like getting dragged along like son of a bitch. How is this small child this strong? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> the, the the kid works out. <laughs> Work out. All right, I'm I'm just gonna just gonna try and Mac Mac this this mage looking to. I missed. I half missed it. <laughs> You're smacking the mage. I have a feeling this did not hit, but you know what? That's a 10. No, that'll hit. hit. That'll hit. Oh, nice. Okay, so that's, uh, what is it? Uh, 15 damage. All right. 
15 as you run up and smack into that mage. I do the thing. <clears throat> I lead the charge with a smack. <laughs> All right. And as that happens, the skeletal mage that you just attacked just looks down to you. And let's see. So, uh, but, uh, to be fair, yeah. the mage probably poses the biggest threat to me. <laughs> so this is going to be attacking Rex, Gavon, and Akaikios. Boy, oh goody! So this is against your magic defense. Uh huh. And this mm -hmm. is a nine. Ah, oh, that barely. Yeah, that'll is. be mine. That is exactly enough to hit. Yeah, that's exactly enough to hit me. Okay. So you are all taking 21 dark damage. Wait. 20 dark damage. Got it. <laughs> all of us? What? No, no, not stuff. you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Woo, I'm in crisis. Uh, I'm not. Uh, I, lo I love that this was accidentally set up to be like, a Kaikios doesn't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, a Kaikios is my de facto the, dad. This, but... <laughs> this dungeon was built quite in error by me. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, it's your it's y'all's turn. Y'all y'all get a get a choice of character now. <laughs> Gavon's next in the hallway. Yep. All right. So uh, Gavon, Gavon is... is going to go in and uh, attack the mage with the axe. Okay, go for it. How about the knave? I need two eights because I'm still weakened. <sighs> Actually, landed this time. No, I refuse. Oh, uh, that's a crit. No. Yes, that'll be 15 to hit. Uh, yeah, that'll hit. Uh, that'll be 21 bolt damage. <laughs> you said 21? Uh, yeah, 21 bolt. All right. That'll be that. And then uh, I get to give an opportunity, correct? Uh, if you crit, yes. Oh, uh, yeah, I got double seven. Okay, then yes. So what would you like Ooh. to happen? Um... I am actually going to take the option to do a bond. Oh, interesting. Create a bond uh, towards the, someone or something. Yep, uh, I've been fighting alongside Rack through this entire dungeon, so... <laughs> I thought you had a bond with Rack. Who was your bond with? No, Anya, remember? Oh yeah, that's right, you were like, fuck the party, I'm going with the NPC that we may never <laughs> see again. <laughs> <laughs> It only it only took like three fastball specials for us to form, finally form that actual bond. And what kind of uh, what kind of bond are you forming with Rack or with Rack? I'm trying to decide between loyalty and affection. <laughs> so like loyal comrade of all arms and trusted and like trusted comrade. Yeah. So are you a comrade in arms or are you a paternal figure with paternal affection for this small <laughs> weird child? Well, we've already established that a Kaikios is the dad. Yeah. <laughs> you can uh, have two dads. You can have two dads. You can have five <laughs> dads. It's a hell of a but polycule. Nah, nah, I'm going to take the affection one because he, he does treat Rack like partially <laughs> like a comrade and partially like a uh, a squire to be protected. Fair. <laughs> and a strange child. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, what a strange child. <laughs> that's that's what All the right. bunch say. strange. <laughs> And with that, is that literally what your sheet says? 
No, it's a oh, by the way, the skeletal mage is officially in crisis. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> the soldier is going to run up and stab Gavon. Okay. Run I up. love the sprite for the soldier, by the way. Yeah. So silly. <laughs> Dang, I, I, I don't know what game it's from. I literally ripped it before stream. <laughs> I would I love to know what game that's from. Uh, so that, that, that is game. that is a 17 to hit you, uh, Gavon. That's going to be an ouch. How much that is 18 points of physical as the skeleton runs up with this dull bronze sword and just bashes it into your back. You said 18? Yes. All right, 17 damage taken. Got it. All right. I want to I wanna keep that skeleton as a pet. <laughs> I am definitely not looking good, but I'm still standing. <laughs> I'm still standing here despite all the pain. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Kaikios is next in the hall, so if we're going by that logic. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's and ganging up on this skeletal mage. This, this is the biggest poor threat. mage. Let's gotta go. Let's be real. It's the biggest threat. Uh, uh, bu 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 bu. <laughs> and I am going to use Shadow Strike, so I roll my Might Die. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Ooh. And. Take three damage. And then I make an attack with my sword. <laughs> that is a 12 to hit. Uh, that will hit. Okay. And that's eight plus 14 is. 22 plus 3, 25 oh. to damage. Well, he's dead. <laughs> he's dead, Goodbye. Jim. Goodbye. You guys are having Goodbye. less issue with these things that are five levels higher than you than you were with the fucking pots. <laughs> <laughs> we thought it was the you other pot. Say that. I'm, I am deep in crisis right now. Yes, because of the fucking pots. That's actually true, yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, Swifty, you're up. All right. I will come into the room, and seeing as I was too late to join the fun with the mage, <laughs> I am going to... Am I still shaken, by the way? Yes. Yep. Y'all have not Shit. rested. Okay. So, let's see. All right, so there's two. Is there one left or two? There's just one. one skeleton. Ah, it's the soldier. Very well. Very well. That works for me. I am going to stare down that soldier as I raise my baton. Mm -hmm. And begin singing that haunting tone that chills it's very bones to well, the bone, whatever. It, it, that magic chant of frost. Okay, it, 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 it's get it. It's getting to be weakened, and because I have an arcane weapon equipped, until next turn, allies deal one extra damage. You said it gets weakened. Yes. Okay. And I will follow it up with my dance of the satyr, causing it to immediately become dazed. All right. As you dance, trying to daze it, it seems <laughs> unfazed. Ah. It doesn't have any eyes. 
It, it has little, like, red orb things that act as eyes. What are they eyes? The, the thought strikes on Alessandra. Shit. The skeleton must be attracted to men. Hmm. Ah, damn it. Imagine. As it eyes, Gavon. <laughs> Gavon, start dancing. <laughs> what? I, I'm making a joke. Why am I dancing? What did I miss? Because <laughs> Alessandra started dancing and I said, you notice the skeleton is just staring at Gavon, ignoring your dance, not phased <laughs> by the day's attempt. <laughs> Alice said the skeleton's attracted to men, so I'm sorry, Dixon. <laughs> take off the shirt. <laughs> take it off. Yeah, take, take off your armor. Take it off. Take it off. <laughs> take off. Take off your armor. There's no way that would end poorly. <laughs> All right. Uh, with that, however, back to the top of the order, which Rex was first. I mean, I mean, I, I'll go first if people want me to, but otherwise, I don't really care. I was going to do my uh, gambit shenanigans to just try and pummel this thing quickly. Do, do, we, want, do we, do we want Gavon to, to take advantage of the skeletal gaze? I, I For a second, I thought you were actually going to say you were going to take your shirt off. <laughs> <laughs> You're not a boy band. <laughs> you could Yet. be. We could be. We have enough people. <laughs> no, no, because oh there's only because th no, because Alessandra's not a guy. Can't, I mean, can't do it. We could, we could dress Alessandra up. It's fine. <laughs> Alessandra, dress in drag. <laughs> what? <laughs> You'll be the front man. <laughs> first, first boy band with a drag king. <laughs> I'm surprised that it would only be the first. I am too. I don't. I I might be talking out my ass though. I don't really follow boy bands. The only one I've ever actually cared about, I don't follow anymore because of uh, who is specifically in it. And I will just say Big Bad Bosses, and if you know, you know. If you don't what know, text me later. But so, who's going? Who's doing what? There's talk of Gavon taking off his shirt and dancing sultry. <laughs> No, we're not doing that. We're going to right. get stuff in this game with it. Well, then do that. All right, then. Uh, plus one to hit. Mm. Uh, that's a crit, by the way. Oh, boy. Uh, so that's going to be an 18 to hit. Okay. And it's going to be 15, uh, 14 bolt damage to it. Well, it gets a plus one from Swifty, I believe. Yeah. Uh, 15 bolt damage then. Okay. And then uh, I lose 10 mind points. So then uh, who wants to have their actual turn? Who wants to just do a free attack? I'm cool. I like free attacks. I would, I would do the free attack. <laughs> uh, so... All right, so Gavon is going to take his axe, swing it into this skeleton's head, which is staring at him, and he is going to shout, No, Alessandra, strike true! So take a free attack action. That's what Oh. I wasn't sure who it was. I'm going to blast it. Yeah. He said it was awesome. Yeah, so you get a plus three to hit, but your high roll counts as zero for the damage. 13 to hit. That will Which means hit. five damage. All right. And then for the action, I'm giving it to uh, Akakios. Oh. A whole ass action. Yep. Full you ass take, action. You can take your turn right now. So make sure you don't half ass okay. it. I, all right. I am going to Shadow Strike again. If I can okay. grab one of my D10s. Ooh. Ooh. Let, let, 
Blah, blah, mm. blah. And take 10 damage. Oh no. It's fine. <laughs> and that's an 11 to hit. If that yeah, wi- 11. That will not connect. Oh no. As you oh, slam is there anything? As you slam into this thing's armor, it stands firm meeting your gaze. It Not makes gaze. quite a good yeah, all of them, all of your gaze. <laughs> it it makes quite a formidable warrior. You you almost respect it from your heart of being like the heart of a warrior, you kind of respect the skeleton. Mm-hmm. I don't well, you're not a warrior. You're a fucking psycho child. <laughs> uh. And with that, the Kaikios, it is going to retaliate against you. Well, good. It's not attracted enough to you to not attack. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it swings for the fences. That is a 15 to hit. That's a hit. That will be 18 physical damage. As he slams his sword into your chest. Okay. All right. And with that, it is uh, between Wreck and uh, Swift or and Elisandra. Wreck Wreck goes because I still have the thing active. True. All right. We're going to do this. Can I keep rolling? Can I keep rolling? Well, question. I might have had too many good rolls this time already. <laughs> I completely missed. You completely missed? One of them actually landed. Oh, you missed the tower. Way. Okay. Oh. oh. <laughs> That's okay because it ended up working in my favor. I finally got it in. So I got a 16 to hit. <laughs> That'll hit. And that's, uh, is that nine? 15 more damage. All right. This thing officially enters. Cri- well, you didn't add your soldier damage, right? No. Okay. This thing officially enters crisis. <laughs> as as you get a solid, solid jab into its armor. Yeah. Alessandra, you were up. Also, I just want to note, I got the funny number in my dice. Yeah. <laughs> nice, nice. <laughs> What's the plan, Alessandra? The plan? To beat this thing up. Is to blast it. Mm-hmm. I like this plan. <laughs> 13 to hit that will hit and that's 13 damage woo love to see it love to see it it is still alive it is still rattling and it is still standing tall Tall. Rattle, rattle. I don't know why I flipped that over. It is back to the top of the order. Who will, who will be going? Anyone? Uh, like, I'll like, go. Like, I was like say, if y'all really don't care, the skeleton will go. <laughs> no, no, I'm just reading some stuff, sorry. That's fine. I went, I went ADHD oh. for like a whole minute and a half there. Well, in the meantime, <laughs> funny dice go burr. That's definitely not going to hit. <laughs> What'd you get? A nine. Oh, yeah, uh, that is definitely not going to hit. Uh, it is going to point its sword to Gavon, and then it will go for a strike on him. It's going on strike, guys. Oh, I missed. You did the exact same thing I did. <laughs> What'd you get? 
No, I, I missed the, the tower. dice tower. And I still oh. rolled the same thing. That is a 12 to hit. Uh, that will hit, unfortunately. All right. That is a uh, number. Uh, 16 yes. points of physical damage. At one. Oof. So close. That does not sound good. So whose turn mm. will it be? Yeah. So far, it's just been a Kaikyos. Yep. So it's between Gavon, Rex, and Alessandra. I mean, Gavon should We've already established it. I'm going last, so. Uh, I, I guess I can punch. Since the skeleton won't be taking a turn yet for a while. Okay. Let me go for another big old punch. I'm just going to throw a haymaker. Get a solid hit. I got a 11. That will not hit. Oh, darn. Gavon, you're up. <laughs> yep. Oh, I never did my uh, opportunity from the last critical, did I? Uh, you did the bond. No, no, I got a second critical, remember? Last time? I, I do not remember. Because you missed on yeah, the last seven, attack. Seven, seven, I did the bond. And the last one I had eight of eight. I did eight and eight. Oh, yeah, no, I guess you didn't. Oops. Um, Is anyone else still to go this turn? Uh, Alessandra still has to go. Yes. Uh, Alessandra, you, you have advantage this turn, then. Sweet. Not advantage, but a plus... Well, yeah, it is called advantage. Never mind. Plus four. Five E has ruined me. To be fair, it's ruined all of us, probably. To be fair, the amount of tabletop games I've played have has ruined me. How many times do I sit there in a 5e game and go, roll a, roll a fortitude save? Oh, that's going to be a miss. Uh, all right. Swing and a miss. Alessandra, everybody seems to be missing the skeleton. Let's see if I make that also happen. He's, he's defending himself well. I also missed the dice tower. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh I my god, you did again. it again! Maybe it'll give you a, a good roll. This is a sign we should all go to bed. Probably. You're a bed. Uh, uh, yeah, not this, not this. usually. <laughs> this is hilarious. 11 plus whatever the advantage thing does. Plus 15. So that will hit. And. And. That makes 10 and. damage. All right. Damage wall in crisis. Top <laughs> of the order. <laughs> Who's going first? Will it be a Kaikios? Will it be Gavon? Will it be Wreck? Will the skeleton tell you to go fuck yourself and take the turn? Skeleton is in crisis, though, you said, right? Yes, he's been in crisis. <laughs> well, if nobody else is going to go, I can throw another haymaker. All right, go for it. You're the first one to claim it. Make the hay. Yes. If I can hit the dice, if I can get to the dice tower, because the dice do not want to hover over the dice tower. One missed again. Exactly one. <laughs> uh, that seems to be the theme of the night. Oh, that's, uh, that's a crit because it's doubles. For me, <laughs> that is that is a that is Double a five. crit. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah. Um, okay, so that would only do eleven damage, but then I can give. I guess I can just give advantage to whoever. True. It's true. You could. Uh. Well, I think. Kaikyos is in the best position to do some damage because, you know, Gavon's about to die. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. True, so, true. I, so I think the advantage will just go to Kaikyos. Yay! <laughs> we'll give it to Dad. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so Kaikyos will have a plus four. <laughs> but it isn't quite a Kaikyos' turn. Not yet. Gavon has to get slapped by a skeleton soldier. Yep. I did punch it real hard and didn't. And you did. did. 
<laughs> I'm so. proud of you, Rex. <laughs> oh, oh, that is only a nine. Carried with the half of the axe. I'm still standing, bitch. <laughs> All right, here, here's your chance to whack him silly. We get one of those scenes where Devon blocks, but blocking while blocking, <laughs> Devon coughs up a little bit of blood. Yeah, that's exactly what's going on, honestly. <laughs> Devon is standing as best he can. I vote Kaikios goes just for flavor. <laughs> All right, I am going to. Go against a different defense and hope that it's lower. Oh, that is double eight. All right, that will will hit. hit, That will crit. Everybody's Uh, critting now. Except for me. Works. I get an opportunity. Is that right? Yep, you get an Mm -hmm. opportunity. Any opportunity that you would like. Uh, I am going to give it... Let me see which of these statuses benefits me. I mean, you could also get like a plot twister. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Or a faux pas. (laughs) Because there's a skeleton can totally say something. (laughs) (laughs) I guess you could make one of us say something. (laughs) What? Uh, what what status effect would reduce its defense? Uh, uh, the one that would lower its dexterity. So if you look at the sheet, whatever slow, one is next to dexterity, yes, yeah, slow. Okay, I'm going to slow it. Okay. It, uh, can it be also slow, so that's good. Takes fifteen plus. Eight is twenty-three damage. It doesn't matter because it's dead. <laughs> <laughs> However, oh, that does oh, matter man. because it heals me for yep. twelve damage. Wait here for a second after the fact. Uh huh. How silly it is to slow a thing that doesn't use its dexterity for defense. True, I forgot that his armor just said it. The first thing he has, the is heavy armor, so it's just twelve defense flat. Yeah. Oh uh, well, it's dead. <laughs> it's dead. As, <laughs> as it is currently, like sword against axe with uh with Gavon, a Kaikios just comes in from the back and pulls what little soul is left from this <laughs> thing, and it just collapses forward, flattering against Gavin. Like if I was gonna just fall back, spread eagle on the ground, panting. Hey yo, spread eagle. <laughs> what? Hey yo, covered oh, in shut up. Up. <laughs> Yeah, covered in cut. This is a Japanese film now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. Here's your King Kong. <laughs> and with that, combat is over. I- I'm gonna vote for arrest. Yeah, same. (laughs) All right, so you are going to each spend an inventory point for the tent. Oh, yeah, 100%. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, so you will rest, so you will heal to full, recover your mind points, and recover from conditions. Yay. 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 And funny enough, I think that is a good point to end here. So we we recover what again? Everything, right? Yeah, you recover everything. Except for inventory points. Those you have to spend money for. Yeah. Mm. Oh my god, I was literally down to one HP. (laughs) Oh my god. That's that one skeletal soldier was a threat more so than anything else. I mean, that seems level 10, isn't it? Yeah. And I you guys are, you you guys are level should be six. level 7. Yeah, you're going to be level 7 after this session. I did, say, I, did not take, I did not take 20 damage. It's true. I will Madden. say, I took at least 80 damage across the session. 
<laughs> and yet you all, you technically never went down. Yeah. <laughs> I took a total of 73 damage during that session. Fucking wild. 10. 15. Oh, it must be nice to be a backline character that doesn't get forced into the front lines just because you exist. <laughs> hey, listen, I'm the only one that's actually fucking died. Look, you didn't die. You got your shit wrecked. And it, in my defense, I get close to death more than everybody else. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> well, I'm close to death, but in a different way. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Hey, ooh, ooh. Hello? Hello? see. With that, we are going to start ending session here. I just so, need to say, I need to get a flail. That's all I gotta say. You need to get a flail? Yeah. What do you need the flail for? For snail both, flailing. Because both uh, Fury and uh, Chimeras have skills that require flails. Mmm. <laughs> Sounds good. Well, we're going to go ahead and end here. I hope everybody has enjoyed this episode of Fabulous Misfits. There will be no Digimon Saturday tomorrow. However, uh, Van, are you still going to be live tomorrow? Uh, Most likely. <laughs> well, Van will probably be live, so make sure you go and check him out while he's live. Live, live the honorary Digimon Saturday without me. Mm -hmm. uh, and then Sunday, I believe, should be Borderlands 3 again, barring unforese or un uh, foreseen circumstances. Uh, let's see. Make sure you check everyone out. We've got Iffy from Iffy Woo VT. We've got Van oh, yeah. from Ventura V. We've got Yoshi from Ophilis. And we've got Swifty from Swift Crescendo. All of them are on Twitch. Make sure you are following all of them. They're amazing friends. You know, Anna, if you want to hear my voice, YouTube does have all of my VODs. Even the embarrassing ones from when I was playing Digimon Survive. Um, but we're going to go ahead and raid out, so make sure that you are using the uh, raid message that I can't have Dusty use because he's not a sub. Fucking scrub. God damn it. There we go. If you are not a sub, though, you can still shout Slime Raid at the top of your lungs. We're going to go raid someone else who is playing a tabletop game. Um, not the same. Oh, I'm sorry, Anna. Uh, but yeah, so make sure you're checking everyone out. Do anyone have anything big coming up soon that they want to, they want to shout out? Uh, I'm going to be trying to continue the X4 series next Thursday. Uh, restarting after the game over horrendousness last night. <laughs> amazing. Amazing. No, no, just a Yuzong Vong hurt. Yes. Yes, they do. Any, anyone else got anything they want to shout out? Uh, yeah. Meow, 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 meow. Van, thank you for the sub. I'm probably continuing on Tuesday since we're we'll to Lars this week. Time sure flies in the pub, doesn't it, Venturave? Seven months already? Venturave. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. Tuesday, I'm going to be doing Descent into Development. We're, we're getting back to it. It's going to be a regular for a while, but we're, we're getting back to the Descent. <laughs> Swifty, Iffy, any anything y'all wanna mm, wanna yeah, shout out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I guess the only thing I really got going because things are getting a little weird, but I'm trying to get a view of you that doesn't involve all the dungeon tiles I towered in front of you. <laughs> More. More uh, Arcadian Savage and maybe some maybe some other shenanigans. I've got a bunch of stormtroopers that are about two weeks overdue for getting punched in the face, so mm -hmm. need to get that taken care of. Hmm. <laughs> fair, fair. So, when you say Arcadian Savage, you mean Glitchy Cause's wife, right? Hey, we actually cleared this time. All right. Well, now it's now it's just to glitch. Now it's gonna become glitchy simps over a B tuber. Yes, uh, that's B nothing new. Tuber. No, 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 no. B tuber, not not V tuber. Alice. Look, I've -tuber. I've met I've met a few B tubers. I'm not. I would be more surprised if she didn't. <laughs> I I think that's fair to say. 
Am I wrong? Hmm. All right, so we're going to go ahead and end here. So thank you again, everybody, so much for hanging out. Thank you, everybody, for watching. And uh, make sure that when we get in here, you scream Slime Raid at the top of your lungs. If you are a sub, make sure you use the Slime Raid emote. That has been given to us generously by Van. Um, and